Hey, what's up, backpackers and hammock campers? This is Jax here. Hey, today I'm gonna do a review for you on GearBest.com's casual camping hammock with the bug net. A couple of weeks ago, they contacted me and asked me if I would, I wouldn't mind doing a review on one of their hammocks. And I said, hey, sure, no problem, as long as you don't mind an honest review. Uh, then I'll do it. They said no problem. So here we are two weeks later. Just got it in the mail. Um, all I've done is open the bag. So I'm going to pull everything out, show you exactly how it comes when it's shipped to you if you order this hammock. All right, let's see what we got in here. The hammock. So maybe this is some directions. Nope, just an invoice. All right. <clears throat> All right, uh, stuff sack. Um, some line. Some rope. I'm guessing this is the suspension and I can already see in here there's some uh, carabiners. Um, I probably will uh, be uh, switching out this suspension. All right, so it looks like at first glance the hammock uh, comes with its own stuff sack that's attached to the hammock. So it just stuffs inside. All right, and that looks about it. Uh, no directions on the hammock, but hey, how difficult can it be? Let's set it up and see what it looks like. All right, guys, I went and got some more line, and uh, I've literally been playing with this thing for about a half an hour total now, and I just for I just cannot seem to get it dialed in. And, you know, the problem is, well, there's a quite a few problems. You've got to have, there's four tie-out points on this thing, as I said earlier, and I'm, ha you know, there's not a lot of trees around here to tie off on. And ultimately, if you had something that was, you know, some extra trees to tie off on, it would be, you know, it'd be great. But, uh, so I'm having to tie off, you know, on one point. And I've tried using the lower points and it just, it, it makes it sag. And then, you know, when you go over here and you get one tightened up, then it throws everything off. And as you can see, it's just, it's crooked. Now, granted, maybe I'm not doing something right, which brings me to my next point is there's no directions in this hammock to even show you how to put it up. And guys, look, I'm, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, okay? But I, I think I, you know, I've been hammocking a long time and I know a little bit about setting up hammocks and whatnot. And I just, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm at a loss about this. I mean, the best thing that I had is when I first did it and I ran that one line across was the best way now I hadn't even got in this hammock yet so that's what I'm gonna try to do now and just to see obviously I mean I got in it a while ago but it was just a while I was setting it up but I didn't really sit in it really good and I wow I can already tell you man this is there's no netting in my face, so that's a good thing. Um, wow. I mean, literally, I'm 5'8", guys. This is, a, this is a short hammock. I'm almost, I don't know if you can see this, but I mean, here's the end of my hammock right here. Now, like I said, I'm 5'8". Let me, let me see uh, how much this hammock is supposed to be. I'm going to have to check my specs. 
um, and see what the length is but this is just entirely uh, too short and the width is I mean I can't even not I can't even really get a flat lay um, and even if I tried to go out I mean you can see here I'm almost in the in the netting right now um, so yeah I'm, I'm not really really excited about that the uh, here's where the zipper goes that's that's I guess that's a stop uh, it's not clean looking but uh, the stitching the stitching looks good um, all right, let me get out and uh, look over something else. I'm going to give you some uh, lengths and widths and some specs on that. Well, right now, just, you know, again, it's it seems to be a well-made hammock, but I'm just really confused about, I mean, maybe this is for a kid? I mean, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get back with you with some specs. All right, guys, so here's the specs. And this is uh, this is according to their website. The length of the hammock is 250 centimeters, uh, or 8.2 feet. The width is 120 centimeters, which uh, comes up to about 3.9 feet. The uh, load limit on it is 150 kilos, which would equal about 330 pounds. Um, it's made out of the 210T nylon taffeta. I told you that earlier. Uh, this hammock goes for $29.46 with free shipping uh, at gearbest.com. It comes from China. Um, <clears throat> I can just tell you right now, it also says that it is for two people. Now, I got a pretty broad shoulders, but I wouldn't say I'm some, you know, a real big guy or anything, but I can just tell you, my wife's very petite, and her and myself could not fit in here, and my grandchild couldn't fit in here with me. So it's definitely only, you know, for one person, a, a, an adult person anyway, um, if you had a, a you know, a, a small child or a grandchild or something like that, you know, I would say, yeah, this, this might be their hammock for them um, but for an adult I just in my opinion I just don't I don't see it I, I can tell you right now I was planning on gonna sleep in this but there's no way there's no way I could sleep in this tonight and get a good a good night's sleep um, secondly I want to mention is with all these lines that's going on here I mean I got a line here a line here um, you know lines over here and I mean I couldn't even it would be hard to get a tarp over this so that you know that's one issue now if you undo these lines this net is going to be hanging in your face so you have to you pretty much have to use the use these lines um unless unless i've just haven't i've overlooked something about putting this up um and again no directions so i mean i know something about hammocks if a person ordered this hammock and didn't know anything about hammocks, I don't even, I, they would probably have more of a problem than I did. Um, you know, despite, you know, all the bad things, I guess, that I've, I'm saying about it, um, I just, uh, it's well made. That's, that's basically, you know, the only really good thing I guess I got to say about this hammock. Um, you know, I did change the sus suspension out on it um, just because, you know, that's what I do. I don't like carabiners, but even the rope that they gave you, which I ended up adding it back onto this spot over here, um, it's, I mean, you're, you're going to have to do some kind of weird knots on the end. And like, if you don't know anything about knots or whatever, I mean, you might be sitting on the ground before the night's over with if you spend the night in this but anyways guys this is the uh gearbest.com hammock um again it, the the price on it is 29 dollars 46 with free shipping 
I think they got a deal on it right now. Um, it's called the Casual Outdoor Camping Hammock with Bug Net. I think they sell this same version of this hammock without the Bug Net. Um, and again, hey, without the Bug Net, it's still going to be too short. I mean, I'm 5'8", and there's, you know, I don't know. I don't know if if they, when, whoever makes this hammock, if they're not taking into account you need to, you know, sleep on the diagonal or what. But uh, GearBass.com, Casual Outdoor Hammock. If you have any questions, you know, shoot me a message. Um, if you like this review, give me a like. If not, you know, give me a dislike. I don't know. There you go.